The Battle of Santiago de Cuba, a pivotal encounter during the Spanish-American War on July 3, 1898, marked a decisive victory for the United States. Initiated by the U.S. Navy's blockade, the engagement began when the Spanish Caribbean squadron attempted a breakout. With superior forces, the U.S. fleet, commanded by Rear Admiral William T. Sampson and Commodore Winfield Scott Schley, boasted modern steel warships. In contrast, the Spanish flotilla, under Admiral Pascual Chavera, faced a dire situation with older vessels and less effective firepower. U.S. dominance in tactics and naval operations led to the destruction or capture of all Spanish ships, without losing any American vessels, highlighting the obsolescence of the Spanish fleet and underscoring U.S. naval ascendancy 